In this tutorial I would like to look at the fastest systems and um, what this gives us is the ability to place a stack of fasteners into the assembly without having to place each one individually and um, on top of that it will give us a little bit more um, streamlining by the fact that it will um, select the most uh, effective fastener for the hole that we're selecting. So under the creating place uh, we can see the fastener system and um, it will start with asking us for the top hole so we can come in here and pick that as our starting point accept that and then um, we need to specify the hole at the bottom that it's going to extend to. Now um, this is using the parts library so um, if you haven't installed that you'll need to install that first and you can see that we've got various different standards in here um, I'm going to use the ANSI standard um, with the metric and to start with we're going to have a hexagonal bolt and um, as I said it's picked up the whole size so it's defaulted to an M5 bolt so now we've placed that into, into the um, system um, we can specify a specific length or um, it's sort of given us just a, a minimum length plus a, an extension so we could change that to be say um, 2 mil. We've also um, decided that we want to use a, a washer at the top as well underneath the bolt head um, so we can come down into our uh, library and pick out the various uh, washer so you can see the top stack includes that washer now and for the bottom stack we want to have not only a washer um, but we will also need a hexagonal nut so we can add that in as well so you can see that it's streamlined our selection process so once we've defined our stack we can click OK and that will generate any necessary um, components that haven't already been used before and um, it actually just builds that all together into a um, convenience stack of components. If you decide that um, it actually should have come in from the other direction you can still use the flip command and that will um, reverse the order of the components in the stack and also if you decided that you needed to rechange something you can come back in here and redefine it and that will redefine the um, components